Welcome everybody, my name is TommyT999 and this is the Star Wars Battlefront Kills of the Week. We are starting with honourable mentions and first up, HM3 comes from TC Carpenter who gets a single pulse followed by a nice little double. Now don't forget, if you want to vote for one of the honourable mentions after you've seen all of the clips, all you need to do is write HM and the number down below in the comments to give it your vote. Will you vote for HM2 from Lemmy2511? And this is all about the U-Wing Gunner Snipe. Nicely done with the Cycler Rifle. And then HM1 comes from RX Rix15, who is going to get a cross-map Cycler Rifle, also getting a headshot for good measure. Now you're about to see a whole host of further clips, and after you've seen them all, yes, you will vote and decide for your favourite. Just write the letter or the letters and number in the comments section, and the one with the most will move on. In the last episode, you voted for LucySG. They now move on to that kill of the month and also get themselves a T999 branded t-shirt. So get in touch via my email to arrange delivery of that as soon as possible. And if you are wanting to get involved in this series and also win yourself a t-shirt, just leave a link to your clip in the comments section as well and this could be you in the next episode. Kill A comes from NedWar99. We're here on the Death Star and it's all about trying to claim the droids and then hold on to them if possible. Good defence work here from Ned War, and is then going to try and move on and capture the remaining droids, or at least hold on to the ones that he's managed to do some awesome work getting hold of. Looking to move on, this next droid gets another kill. Droid is captured, and it's time to move on and continue this destruction that he's causing. Rebels ripping it up. Following that, we have got Kill B. This is Mowgli27 playing as boss, and this overall score at the end of this streak, his game ended 171 kills to zero. Yes, this is just a snippet of that, but you can see from just this part, the Rebels had no chance in hell. They keep on coming pouring across, but Boss is brutalizing them one by one, just getting points after points, and yes, he ends 171-0. Kill C comes from Jack, and I'll tell you what, this is all about defending that pod. Yes, reclaimed it, and now the defense is on, and it's a great piece of work. Lots of melees going on, lots of close range action, but he is not gonna let that pod go easily. He wants the points on the board, he needs his team to get back into this match. He does finally get taken down, but they did get a point on the board. Kill D comes from Divinity Riser, and Jin is loving these bushes, getting a very cheeky flank streak. These troopers, no chance at all, Jin on absolute fire here, wanting to deliver victory for their team. Voilà. Quand je te mets des voix dans tous les 1, ça passe bien. Hein. 
it is pretty clear if you need a beach clearing, just call Jin Erso and she will deliver. This is Kill E, it comes from RJM Lab, and at the moment he's going up against Luke Skywalker and a whole host of rebels. But once Luke has been removed out of the equation with that melee, it's then focus all on the rebels. One by one they keep coming, but also look out for an awesome multi-kill right near the end of this streak. A lovely thermal there, finishing things off, and when you're killing rebels, the more the merrier. This is Kill F. It comes from Zlob HD, playing as Vader, currently in a two versus three situation against Skywalker, Solo, and Nun. Who knows where Fed is, but it doesn't matter because Zlob is gonna go for it. He's going off as Vader, as I say, and the dark side is going to rule this day. Your choice for Kill G comes from Jellybutton010413. Welcome to the Rebel Wooded Wonderland, where Imperials are forbidden. And if any get seen, they get taken down pretty quickly, especially by Jellybutton. Now don't forget, once you've seen all of the clips, you need to vote down below in the comments for your favourite. One of these will move on to the kill of the month and then maybe have the opportunity of going on to the kill of the year. So once you've seen them all, just write the letter or the letters and number of the one that you want to move on down below in the comments to give it your vote. They have control of the battlefield. We need to take the fight to them. in your work, Jelly. This is Kill H. It comes from Gongsho38, and their task is cargo ship containment. Yes, disarming the explosives, making sure these ships do not get blown up. They're protecting and guarding with all they have got. The rebels are going to struggle to get past them. Now don't forget, if you want to get involved in this series and get a clip sent in, all you need to do is leave the link to it down below in the comments section, and this could be you in the next episode. Gongsho sticking to their task as best they possibly can, getting another disarm in there, plus a nice little streak right at the end there with some huge kills, nearly getting over a thousand points. And every time the rebels come in again, Gongsho is back there once more to keep on wiping them out. Your penultimate choice is Kill I. It comes from Mighty Jack 11 and Boss, well, he is taking control in a brutal fashion. And you'll see what I mean as soon as they get into that corridor. Yeah. 
After clearing outside, it's time to move inside and let the carnage commence. Say goodbye, Rebels, and even, yeah, you don't even try and sneak up on him. You get one more, for good measure. And your final choice, it is Kill J. It comes from Filthy Hornet 177 and here in the airspeeder has picked up one kill, but his next priority is taking down Vader. Yes, Vader is very close, tried a few passes, but as he comes in this time, still doesn't have any joy but has got a better positioning for knowing exactly where he is. And once Vader is out of the way, it's time to move on to the walkers. So Vader is no more, but there are still two walkers to deal with. And Filthy Hornet, he's all over it. One is down, the second is now connected. If he can pull this off, he's going to have killed Vader and taken down both walkers in the matter of just a minute. That is the way to win a game. So now it is over to you. Yes, you vote and decide down below in the comments which your favourite is and which one should move on. Just write the letter or the letters and number of the one that you want to give your vote to and one will move on to that kill of the month. And as I say, if you want to get involved, just leave a link to your clip down below in the comments section as well. And this could be you looking for a place in the kills of the week, kill of the month and then the kill of the year. If you'd like to check out some previous videos, you can. They are linked on screen now. Follow me on social media. All of those are at the bottom of the screen. I've been Tommy T Triple Nine. Thanks for all of your support and all of the clips that you've sent in over the last week. And I'll speak to you again in the next one.